To upload the data from Turnkey's brake testing equipment to the MTS or MOT testing system, you have to install the brake testing app on your PC or an Android device. This demo is for PC application, you can check our YouTube channel for the demo of Android application. Go to turnkey-instruments.com slash resources and download the brake testing app for PC from the full installer section on the page. You can find more details here. You will need the key files from DVSA to allow this app to upload the results to MTS. You will also need a USB PC link cable to connect your brake tester with the PC. If you want to find out more about the connected MOT equipment or how you can generate the key files, click on the link in the description. Make sure you have all the required items. Once you have downloaded the application installer, double click on the installer to start installation. Select more info and click run anyway. The system will ask for permission to install the application, select yes to continue. Here you can select the location where you want to install the application. Click next. I will create a desktop shortcut. Click next. Click install. Once the app is installed, it will give you the option to install the driver for USB PC link cable. If you have already downloaded the results from your brake tester on this PC, you may already have the drivers, you can skip this step in that case. Otherwise continue to install the drivers if you are using the brake tester with your PC first time. Once the installation is finished, double click on the application shortcut on desktop to start the application. This application requires Java to work. Most computers have Java installed already but if you don't have Java installed, it will show you this message. You should not see this message if you already have Java installed. I will quickly show the process of Java installation. When you click OK, it will take you to the official Java website where you can download the Java and install in your PC. Once Java is installed, restart the brake testing application. When you start the application, the first thing you need to do is to set up MTS client with the key files from DVSA. The application will show you this message if you have not set up the MTS client. Click MTS client button. This will open a file chooser option. Select the password protected zip file for the DVSA keys and certificates and click open. Enter the password for the zip file. The app will unzip the keys and save them and show a confirmation message. Now you can see the list of active MOT tests in your account by clicking Update Vehicles button. Select a vehicle from the list. Now select the type of brake tester you have. If you have G-Meter, it is selected by default. If you have performed the brake test, Connect your G-Meter with the PC via USB cable and select the correct port. You can refresh ports if you do not see any ports in the list. Click Download button. This will show you an option to select the type of brake you have performed the test for. I will select Service Brake first. It should download the data from the G-Meter. A message will be displayed to perform the parking brake test and upload results in the app. Now perform the parking brake test and reconnect your G-Meter to the PC and click download button. This time select parking brake. This should download the result and upload to MTS button should become enabled. You can now upload the results to MTS. Click the button and confirm the vehicle registration number and click yes. After the results have been uploaded, the app will give you the option to clear results and start a new test. You can confirm the results on the MOT test website before clearing the results from the app. Or you can start a new test from the options as well. For G-Meter Plus, the process is same. Select a vehicle from the MOT vehicle list. Select G-Meter Plus from the instrument type. 
click download data button. Because GMeter Plus can store three tests in its memory, you can perform both service and parking brake test and download the results together. Select the tests how you have saved them in the GMeter Plus. I have performed test 1 as service brake test and test 3 as parking brake test. You can select different test using the scroll buttons. Click done button to download the result to the app. Once the results have been downloaded into the app, you can upload the results to MTS. The options menu has the following options. Start a new test to clear previous results. Watch demo video. Download PC link driver.